The world's best kickboxers took center stage Saturday night for its Showtime Amsterdam, which was presented by the Fight Network. In the main event, heavyweight champion Hetsy Herges went to war with British fighter Chris Knowles. Herges dominated this fight from the opening bell, and Knowles showed some heart eating a number of shots. In the second, the Egyptian proved to be too much as he connected on a right uppercut, followed by a left knee, sending Knowles to the canvas. Champion returns. In a rematch from their 2010 K1 bout, Holland's own Robin Van Roosmalen took on aggressive Moroccan fighter Mohamed Kamal. Both of these fighters went tooth and nails for the entire three rounds, putting on arguably the fight of the night, but in the end it would be Mohamed Kamal taking home the unanimous decision victory. The max 85 kilogram championship was on the line as Sahak Perpayan took on Hedsi Herge's teammate Amir Ziyada. Despite Ziyada being the larger fighter in the fight, it was Parparian landing cleaner shots and doing an effective job of countering 303 rounds. In the end, the judges would award the decision to Sahak Parpian, taking home the vacant title. Hafid El Bustadi and Mohamed Mahar battled in a 70 kilogram affair. Bustadi unloaded in the first, landing some brutal flying knees and combinations towards the end of the round. The durable Medhar ate a number of shots throughout this contest, but couldn't keep up with the pace of Bustadi, who earned the unanimous decision. In the 65 kilogram division, Frank Paradis Vilches dominated Robert Van Nimmigen over three rounds with a number of power shots and kicks, earning the unanimous decision victory. Opening up the night's televised broadcast, Giga Chaikazi squared off with Russian Evgeny Kurovsky. Chikadis dropped Kurovsky with a beautiful right hook in the opening stanza, followed by a big knee in the second. A sneaky fake and a nice knee up the middle. The Russian would rally in the third, but it wouldn't be enough as Giga Chaikadis takes home the unanimous decision victory.